It's officially a new era for Bryant Bulldogs football. The school hired former Bronze Star James Perry as its new head coach in January. And with spring football underway in Smithfield, he's wasting no time. Here's J.P. Smallins. The new pace has been set at Bryant. Up tempo on both sides of the ball. The goal under first year head coach James Perry. He told us from day one it's going to be chaos. So, you know, we were, we were ready for that. We were ready for the fast tempo, um, fast plays, you know, snap the ball as quickly as you can. So it's been a learning experience, no doubt. But, you know, it's been it's been a positive experience and we're getting better every day working on the attention to details. Oh, we are going to be a totally different team conditioning wise. We are going to be in the fourth quarter because a lot of games we had in the second half usually slipped away from us this time. There is no excuses. We are going full four quarters attacking football every single down. We're going to be right after them every single play. Replacing the NEC's leader in touchdown passes, second team all leaguer Dalton Easton, the biggest point of emphasis for the offense. It's a fun position to play when you play fast, but it's very mentally challenging. So, you know, for us, those kids have really embraced getting in the film room with me, um, you know, trying to get in their playbooks and learn the whole thing. And then, you know, most important thing over the next 10 practices will be that. They're really the engine. Um, they, they're going to they're gonna drive how fast we can play. The Bulldogs finished 4-2 in conference play last fall, one game behind St. Francis and Duquesne, the Red Flash earning the league's automatic NCAA berth, an achievement Brian has yet to reach as a Division I program, but one that Perry hopes will be in play for a deserving senior class. That's a great goal to have, to win that NEC and, and go to that, that tournament. From President Makeley to, to Bill Smith, we just have so much support, you know, at the at the uh, at the school wide level, and the kids sense that, and they know uh, a lot has been invested in us. We embrace those high expectations. In Smithfield, I'm J.P. Smallins, Eyewitness Sports.